Hello, how are you guys doing today? It's Doll. Welcome to my channel and today I'm gonna give you a warning because this video is long, stressful for me and I think this game was quite terrible which probably why I didn't put it on my channel even though I recorded it much sooner. And the reason this is is because it's very different from the last three games I showed you in the last video because there weren't any big huge knockouts, there wasn't any big giant setups. This is the game that's not against the Mega Pokemons and those Aggron, those Gardevoir. This is the game against Suicune with Safeguard, with Mind Shells and Focus Sash. It dragged on horribly and one point halfway in I just cut the video feed and I randomly decided just to continue the game and one of us kind of just gave up because this game sucked. Are you still here and gonna watch this? Alright, even more. Hello there and welcome to next match. Let's get started. Sean 2001. Alright, psychic. I'm gonna pick heads. It's gonna be heads. It's heads. I knew it. See? I'm great at guessing these coin flips. Now, I'll be going first because going first usually has the advantage, including this game. Now, fortunately, I'm starting off with Togepi as my active. That's okay. That's okay. Ooh, not bad. First, let me Ultra Ball out. Now, I'm gonna discard Energy and Lysander. Not too important at the moment. And I will take out. Let's see, where are you? My first Shaman. Gonna go ahead and throw an energy down on Togepi to minimize my hand as much as I can. And there we go. Rayquaza. Rayquaza. I'm gonna go ahead and evolve my Rayquaza, ending my turn. And that'll be it. That'll be turn one. Now I can do that because Delta Evolution evolve on first turn. So there we go. My bench has only one more space, hopefully for another Shaman, and we're just gonna Shauna and see what I get. Next turn, if I get Togekiss and Togetic, I'll be able to quickly accelerate my energies. Now, let's see, my opponent is playing Korna, so he can pick up a Fighting Pokemon and an Item card, which is gonna be a Repeat Ball and a Floatstone. So, Repeat Ball, Mind Fu. Alright, so these. Fighting Pokemon, actually, uh, I have a resistance to all fighting, so we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna go ahead and attach another, em well, just an energy onto my Mega Rayquaza. Sky Field, here we go. And Shauna, come on, hope it gets lucky. It's not lucky at all. Yeah, so that's all I can do. I'll end my turn. Alright, so what we got? All I have, I'll be able to play Shauna one more time. And hopefully get a better shuffle if I use the Verse Seeker, because Juniper will destroy some of my energies. I don't quite like, want that. So looks like he's got Mind Shao out. It's only gonna do 20 damage because of my resistance to my core Pokemon. But, unfortunately for Toga P, there it goes. Oh, he decided to put that back into his hand. Let's send out the big gun, Mega Rayquaza. Alright. Big Bull is out. And... He's gonna send out Trap Pinch. He should have sent out the Rebel Substitute. But, we'll see. I'll go ahead and throw in... I'm not gonna play Shauna, I'm gonna be aggressive and play Juniper for a bigger card draw. Looks like it's gonna be Rayquaza. So good tick. I'm not sure if I can play another energy card. Nope. Let's go ahead and throw Shaman. Get two more cards out. Spirit Lake. Nice. Fortunately, I cannot attack, and that'll be it. All right. So, gotta be waiting for my opponent. Scar that Spirit Link. So, if I evolve, I'm not gonna be able to keep my turn. An attack. So 
He's got a big, large army of mind foos and trepinch. They may evolve into something quite dangerous. Ooh, Cores, what a nice counter play. This is gonna give him quite a huge amount of cards. Flip a coins, if heads, discard energy to defending Pokemon. This could slow me down. It's removing. You switched my stadium with the training center, but that's okay. That's usually a good thing because I would have thrown Shaman off, protecting myself from a future knockout. Looks like he evolved it, and didn't I didn't see what happened there. All right, now Mega Rayquaza is charged up. Gotta go ahead and play Juniper again. Okay, there's the Toga Kiss I'm looking for. Woo! And looks like I'm gonna be drawing some energy. I need another one because I think Team Flare's gear is on my uh, Pokemon. And we'll just drop a Spirit Link, Mega Rayquaza, again. And that's it. I cannot evolve this Mega Rayquaza. Don't have a Spirit Link. Emerald Break. All right. Looks like there's a Suicune down there. That means I'm gonna have to actually fight with Togekiss. But he's not throwing Suicune out. Why? Hmm. Okay. So, Mind Fu is coming out. And he looks like he's got a lot of Robo Substitutes, so this game will draw out. Oh, Koras! No! 10 card draws. Luckily, I have resistance to fighting, so this will counter this strong energy's effect. I'll only take 40 damage. So all these cards will go back into his hand, but I can take it. Now, Suicune's out. Let's go ahead and throw down energy and Togekiss, and I cannot do anything this turn. I'm going to go ahead and play Ultra Ball. We'll discard Togekiss and this energy card and I'm gonna go ahead and get uh, there's no more there's no more shamans in that case I'll grab uh, there's no toga oh there you are togepi just throw togepi down I cannot because I don't have the stadium just go ahead and use emerald break for now does no damage because of the safeguard and he's got quite a knife of annoying robot substitutes so, let's see, my Fu's coming out again. He's gonna retreat this Suicune and just keep hitting me for free. Oh, he threw away his substitute. Good. It looks like my opponent's just gonna try to keep on kicking me until I go down. With uh, What I mean is a uh, high arrow turn in which he just attacks and all the cards go safely back into his hand, allowing me not to knock out a mind shall the Achilles heels is there always has to be an active Pokemon so once Suicune and Robo Substitute is out of the way I'll just be knocking those pride cards out also my opponent's damage is quite low and I have resistance to pretty much this entire deck so I'll be okay focus sash ah okay so, Focus Sash, what that does is I won't be able to knock it out in one hit, which I was supposed to. Alright, let's play Shauna. What do I have? Energy I need for Togekiss to attack. Go ahead and retreat. Togekiss is out. And unfortunately, I can't Ultra Ball anything that's useful, so Fairy win. There we go. Once Sui Goon is out the way, I'll be clear. I'll be clear and ready just to fire. All right. My Chow's getting annoying. Getting annoying. Okay. Two my Chow's down. We'll see if I can pull this off. Oh boy. This is gonna be long. All right, mine shout. Nope, corner. Let's get another trip pinch out, but he can't play it. His bench is full, and Skyfield is not out. 
Darn, I wish I had a sound stadium at this moment. But if I did, set up wouldn't I'd work. So, all right, this dowsing machine. Exactly what in the air does he need? Don't see anything that could potentially be game changing. Oh, he's gonna come back into the line. All right then, in that case, I'm gonna go ahead attach an energy to my Mega Rayquaza. Retreat, Togekiss, for uh, Mega Rayquaza. And here we go, attack, Emerald Break. So now, Mega Rayquaza's back out. If he sends Sui Queen again, I can easily knock it out. And now let me check what's down here. Is the Zandra's trump card down there? Yes. How many verse seekers are down there? One. Two. Alright. That means nothing's going back into my hand. This is ten cards. I have ten turns to beat him. Ooh. I kind of want those verse seekers back now. Okay. And my opponent is using Lysandra's trump card, so all those cards are going back into my hand. Awesome! Now instead of 10 cards left, I have 28. Okay. 40 damage. Very slowly working down my um, Mega Rayquaza. So now that I have... Uh, there's nothing I can play in my hand right now. My bench is full. Gonna go ahead and Juniper. Lysandra. Unfortunately, I cannot play it this turn. So, gonna go ahead and throw this down. And evolve my next Mega Rayquaza. Oh, there we go. I forgot I, I should have beaten play, played Skyfield this turn. Throw down the Togepi, but this this will do for now. All right, it's got Floatstone. Oh, this is annoying. This is annoying. What is? I haven't seen this actually being being used. What's this for? Charge energy. Doesn't do anything. Nor does vibration. Right, we're gonna send these mind foods down to the discard pile. I believe. I don't think I'll no, I won't be able to do that. Is this fighting Pokemon is attached? Alright. Can I let's see how many focus ashes are down here? One, two, and three. What's this? Is this have a focus ash? No. Okay, so we go ahead is out. In this case, I'm gonna do what I tended to do last turn. Skyfield, Togepi. Let's let's get some prize cards. We'll take this out. This is the only Pokemon I can knock out with. And roll break. There we go. I draw my next prize card. And this could be a bit annoying. Very, very annoying. Oh, alright. Looks like Trip Pinch. This Trip Pinch is also vulnerable to a Lysander. I'll see if I can grab that. Fortunately for Mega Rayquaza, this may be the last turn for it to be out in front. Alright. Heads. He's gonna draw seven new cards. But what for? Alright. I'll just go ahead and throw Shaman down on the field. Off the field, which is. Good for me. 40 damage. Alright, this is the last turn I can fight before it kicks the bucket. So, I'm gonna go ahead and place that sky field, throw Togepi down, and now it's time to go back. I'm gonna go ahead and send out Togekiss, because it can actually destroy that Suicune. And we're gonna play Shauna. Come on, force Togekiss. Ooh. Uh, Spirit Link. Unfortunately, they're all in their Mega Forms, so in that case, let's see what's in the mail. Ultra Ball. Alright, that, that'll that work. I will Ultra Ball out a Spirit Link, and this Ultra Ball that I do not need. And we'll take out... Uh, there's no Shaman, so I'll just take Togetic. Evolve. I've already played a support card, I believe, but I'll just grab it. We'll just take um, 
Juniper. That'd be good. And let's get rid of, well, at least wound this Suicune. So now, I have to charge up another uh, Togetic quickly in order to, well, get rid of the Suicunes. Just in case. Yeah. In case this Togetic goes down. And my opponent being annoying with focus sashes and mind foos drawing the game out. Oh man. Alright, rare candy. It looks like maybe he'll be able to evolve and use these trip inches. And Flygon's out. Which one is this? Anytime between turns, if this is your active Pokemon, put a damage counter on each of my po on my Pokemon. You're gonna send out this card? Oh, knocking out my Toga Kiss. Well, it's gonna only last one turn, though. Oh, what the? Is this? What? Okay, got it. That was the effect. Now let's play Juniper. And I'm gonna evolve my Toga Tick. Now there's nothing else I can do. Let's get rid of this Emerald Break. It's just the turn that evolved, and it's gone. Alright. Now, nope, I have a fully healthy Mega Rayquaza out, and if, if it's gonna last just as long as the last one, then I'll be good. I need another Bench Pokemon quite quickly. That way, when he disguise, discards my Sky Field by playing a Stadium, I can just throw this into the discard and Lysander trump card it back out. Okay. Birch. Coin flip. Let's see if it's heads or tails. Tails only four cards. Alright. Kind of kind of odd. If he throws any of his Suicune out, they risk being destroyed. But I can't actually harm any of this. Oh, he has an Agis Slash. Whoa! Well, I don't have any special on each, each card, so put, is he is smart and just discarding it? All right, Sui Kun is out. Let's see, what do I need? Uh, who's vulnerable? Is this thing have a Focus Slash? I think it does. I'm not gonna bother checking. Let's take this Trip Pinch out. I'm gonna start working on my Togetic, and we will Emerald Break. Alright, two more prize cards. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. It's a Shaman, yes! Go ahead and... Ah, it's no, no good way to use the Shaman next turn. Oh, right! Well, he's continuing his uh, very low damage per turn onslaught with his fighting, but very resilient fighting deck. Like, very, very resilient. Having a Great and tough time because I can't one shot his Pokemon or even attack some of them. Suicune Safeguard can't attack it. These things with Focus Ash prevent them from dying, technically. It's a cool deck. But I really think it's a cool deck, so when I say this, it's. I mean it. I mean it. Cool deck. Oh. Robo Substitute. Alright, so now that uh, Suicune's out, we're gonna go ahead, charge this up. I'm gonna throw. Oh, yeah, that's right. It doesn't work. Because I have six cards, and who's vulnerable? Looks like all these things have focus sash. So, in that case. Eh? I didn't say that. This is Okay. Let's throw down Togepi, and I will throw down Toga Tick right on this Toga Kiss. I think I messed it up. Uh, it didn't work. What, is there something disabling me? I should have got card draws. Anyways, I'll just go ahead and throw a Spirit Link down, and I'll just attack. Can't do anything, I'll just take the turn. Good deck. Or, what should I say? 
innovative, innovative deck strategy. There we go. Filters blocking. Can't even say cool tech because I must be cursing or something. Focus sash on a Robo substitute. Ah, what do you know? Come on, discard my sky field. Hmm, maybe I should get something to discard my own sky field. Yes! Throw down this Rayquaza, and what else do I don't need? I don't need Shaman. Got it! Yes! I wonder if he knew that. He knows that. Alright, training stadium is out. Not really. My damage potential way too high to worry about that. GG? Not yet, not yet. Still gotta work my way out. Alright, looks like he's gonna send a, a Robo Simpsons. Oh. Okay. Wow, what an exhausting match. Is anybody really still here after all that? Well, if you actually made it here, I guess thank you for enduring all that. If you like a video, please like and subscribe, and if you want any of my music, they'll be here on this page. I'll put a link to it down below. Later this week, it's either going to be Articuno or Pyroar. Not sure which one I'm going to put out yet. I have both decks ready to go. Anyways, thank you. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.